Sam Wonderman. Hey, I got something I want to talk to you guys about. You know, I'm kind of an adventurous guy. And in my many years of living, like I said before, I'm well past half century. I try a lot of different things. I like to experience different experiences. And the reason is, we only got one life to live. Just one. One life. And there's a whole lot of stuff out there to experience. I mean, there's all kinds of nature stuff. There's thrilling, exciting sports you can do. There's all kinds of different people. There's all different types of arts you can learn, whether it's like playing my guitar like I got right here, or whether you're drawing something or writing a book or whatever. There's so much to do. But you know what? People don't do that. All they're doing is hurrying around thinking they're getting stuff done. They hurry up and get up in the morning. Then they hurry up and get ready for work. Then they hurry up to work. Then they get to work and then they want to hurry and get away from work. Then they want to hurry and get home. Then they're tired. So they want to hurry up and eat. Get some fast food or something. <laughs> fast food. So anyway, they want to eat something. And then they're so tired, they want to hurry up and get to bed. And then start the whole stupid thing over again. Well, you know what? All you're doing is hurrying to die. That's right. You're hurrying to get to the end of your life. And in the meantime, you miss out on all the stuff that's fun and interesting and rememberable. I don't know if that's a word. But you know what I mean. People in such a hurry to die. You get on the road, and I got a video about this too. People don't want to drive the speed limit. Whew. They drive like they're nuts. They drive this way and that way, and they're talking on the phone, doing all the stuff. You're going to kill yourself, people. For what? Just slow down and take life easy. Life don't got to be hard. It doesn't have to be stressful. Sure, there are some things in life that are going to be hard to do. Are hard to figure out. That's life. There's going to be things in there that stress you out. That's life too. But you sit back and you think about, okay, whatever this is that's going on today, is it going to make any difference tomorrow, a week from now, or six months from now? Most likely it ain't. So when I say, do what you need to do to have a comfortable life. Have a job, earn some money, put some away so when it's time to retire, you can retire and still be happy. Do things with your partner, whether it's going on a trip or watching a movie or sharing a meal. Do stuff with your partner. And also go out and look for adventure, whatever your kind of adventure is. My kind of adventure is the outdoors and going out to Colorado and going to hiking around here in Missouri, and going on float trips. Or if I want to kind of rest my mind a little bit, I play my guitar. There it is. That's one of them. I play my guitar. And then with that, I can also give something to other people. So I'm making some use of my time rather than running around like what they used to say, a chicken with his head cut off, and really not getting a whole lot of nothing done. So anyway, stop hurrying up to die. You're going to die. It'll come, but don't rush it. Be smart and sensible. Do what you got to do and live your life so that it's fun. And live your life so that when you do pass away, people can say, you know what? That person had a good, good life. That's all. Don't hurry up and die. Keep on living and live life as much as you can. That's what I do. Oh, Cletus M. Waterman, I'm out of here. I'll catch you later. Bye now.